Hi friends, I'm Sudeep and welcome back to my new video. On this video, I'm going to show you how to fix command prompt not opening problem. This type of problem may occur sometimes due to the presence of malware on your computer. So before jumping into the further steps, first scan your computer for malware. For that, open your antivirus and perform a full scan of your computer. If scanning didn't work, then go to this PC. For that, simply go to File Explorer and right click on this PC and click on Properties. On this window, click on Advanced System Settings. On this window, select the Advanced option. Under the Advanced option, look for Environment Variables option. Once you find it, just click on it and on this window, go to system variables. Under system variables, go to path option and double click on it. On this window, make sure at least these four variables are there. If any of these variables is missing, then click on new and add the missing variables there. While adding it, make sure the letters and numbers are exactly the same as shown on this screen. I have also given these variables in the video description below, so you can copy and paste it from there as well. After you finish adding, click on OK. After that, close the window and restart your PC and check if the command prompt is working or not. If it didn't work, then move to the next step. On this step, we are going to use registry editor. So if the registry editor is also not working on your computer, then you can jump to next step. If you are having the same issue with registry editor, please check out my another video. The link is in the video description below. So to open the registry editor, go to search bar and type registry editor and right click on registry editor and click on run it as administrator. On the registry editor window, expand as key local machine option. Under as key local machine, look for software folder and expand it. Under the software folder, look for policies and expand it once you find it. Under the policies folder, navigate to Microsoft folder and expand it as well. And look for Windows folder under the Microsoft folder and expand it. Under the Windows folder, look for System subfolder and select it once you find it. After that, on the right hand side of your screen, if there is Disable CMD option present, then right click on it and click on Delete to delete it. After that, close all the windows and restart your computer and check if it is working or not. If not, then go to File Explorer again and right click on this PC and click on properties. On this window, click on advanced system settings. Here, select system protection option and click on system restore. On this window, click on scan for affected programs. It will show the list of programs that might be removed during the system restore process. So if you have something important, then keep a backup of it. After that, click on next and click on finish. Hope one of these methods has solved your problem. Thank you so much for watching this video.